In the next program, we are going to print all the ASCII chart on your output screen. We know that basic ASCII value starts from 0 and end at 255. So I'm using a variable i inside of a for loop which will start from 0 and it will go till 255. And inside of this for loop, I am printing i twice but first as integer value and then next as character value. So on the screen also I'm adding slash t which is a tab character to add some space between two prints on each iteration. So your final output would be something like this. On the first iteration 0 will be printed then dash then corresponding ASCII value of 0 and then after some space 1 and then corresponding ASCII value of 1 and then in the third iteration 2 followed by its ASCII value and so on. So your loop will go on till 255 and its corresponding ASCII value. So in between of this printing when 65 occurs capital A will be printed on 66 capital B will be printed and so on similarly somewhere small a and small b will also be printed so apart from these alphabet series other ASCII characters are usually used for decoration purposes or those are special symbols and those all you can see after writing this program